say this about it, that makes a nice, strong patch. Uh, you know, I can tell just by grinding on it that it's good and solid and sturdy. I wonder if that's why, uh, I'm sure somebody will tell me, I'm, I wonder if that's why people would use a patch like this rather than one that overlays. Just, maybe it's just because it, maybe where it's got the edges open, the weld can get down between both edges and seal that up pretty good. But uh, that feels good and sturdy as I'm grinding on it there. I, I don't know if you can see it from the underside or not. I'm kind of curious about what it looks like myself. It is kind of handy that the metal just happened to be blue, ain't it? I won't even have to paint that. It's already the right color. I'm just joking. Don't write in now. I'm just joking. Anyway, that's what it looks like from the underside. Hey, doggies. It's kind of fun. I had some holes that I'd knocked in the side of this, so I did a little welding from this side too on that lip. And I was experimenting with my speed and heat. This part up in here, I welded hotter and faster than this part out here, but I, I'm almost wondering, because this is so stringy looking, if I wouldn't have been better off to just weld this out here on a higher heat too and, and all. Anyway, uh, I'm going to grind on that a little bit more, and I'm probably going to call it a day. I got to... I don't like to work real late on the weekend because I have to work. I have to work real late when I work at work, so I kind of can knock off and hang out with Honey Baby when it gets kind of evening time, and I can tell by where the sun is that it's getting on toward time for me to knock off pretty soon. So, with that said, we'll give it a give it a rest pretty quick. I did want to say this, so uh, I'm having this incredible love affair with this hot rod right here, and I really, really, really had to use extraordinary. Uh, willpower to not get this thing out of here today and go right around in it and instead to stay home and work on this Jeep. Now don't get me wrong, I'm, I like this Jeep a whole lot, but when we have a nice day like today and it's uh, October and I know they won't last, <laughs> we're not going to get a lot more of them. And I got them new big tires on the back there and got the springs all softened up. Oh, she's just, she's just making me want to go for a ride, you know. It's like being in love with a woman, you just can't wait to get back to her. But I'm two-timing her a little bit with this Jeep. That's okay. It'll all work out good in the end. Y'all have a nice day.